Here we are, beautiful red line. Poppy loves Laura Mirage's wall. Up front we have Andre Ramos. That is a graduate student that won the Denny Roselle Fellowship that came out. This is three acts. Survey of shame, emotion, and oblivion. It's kind of a show about the time we're in right now in cancel culture, uh, realities of fiction, uh, and the opening piece with Heather Oakless that has these beautiful little 3D sculptures I consider, consider photography is the body bag and we we were all uh kind of thinking we're gonna die us older people in this room is the unperson project from mexico city that with andrea and susan that is people that are it's a project they're working on of the vaporization of photographs and removing people out of photographs um which is a discussion on cancel culture uh, over this side is Marja. And Tiana Graves. We have Poppy Sink. Taya. 60 White Man. Love Norma Cordova, uh, Polaroids, Jared Anderson's pieces that are 2021. Their survey, this is our Denver Collage Club along these walls. We have George P. Perez and Janice and Paula Gillen. I was thinking of blowing up gigantic, but these pieces, it's about women in space and exploration and women power. Here is wonderful Chris Bagley's installation with a really fantastic video in the background with Caitlin. Here is Shame Radiant by Todd Edward Herman for a super strong piece on different topics of dealing with shame. This is Kelly Eisworth, pardon my creep. And Britlin Tracy. That is a study of story about online dating in the dialogue of electronic dating. There's Lori Links putting her work up. And we have Donald Bodness, a little, who's a ground painter. I'm very excited to have this piece into my collection. Thank you, Donald. Here's another little Andre Ramos. A 
days. Or moving on with our wonderful graffiti artist that draws herself in the side, Miss Claire Prim. That you see that's what she kind of looks like with the glasses and places her into she's on to different significant cultural people. And here is these wonderful Teresa Anderson's collages of women's mouths. And I love these pieces from South America. Matto Resnick. He's been in our collage club since its beginning, including Mathro U. Rose from Paris. We met when he showed in Denver uh, many years ago. And Matto is from Buenos Aires. Here's Pablo from Czech Republic. This is a story about the reality of fiction, which one is real. We have Jeremy Dorrance over there, this beautiful piece by Samuel Mata. And Sutra, beautiful piece. And that's the show. Thank you for joining us. I missed a couple artists. I get name blocks. And... Red line is so beautiful. Here. This is for the people who are not there. Oh, Here we are. That's a nice, partially spaced crowd. Hey. Hey. My IG. Gotta do the IG first. Here we go. Hello. Thank you for coming. <laughs> Look who's here. <laughs> That's really poppy. Uh, I know, see, just, it's these girls. This is for all the people that aren't here. <laughs> hey, Mark, how are hey, you? Good, how are you? It's fun, isn't it? Oh my god. So good crowd. I love this opening with little kids and little stuff. Oh my god. And artists and the winds. And Carol Keller, that's Teresa Anderson called Women's Lips. No, Women's Teeth, Women's Mouths, Women's Mouths. Carol Keller gave me my first show at the River Gallery. <laughs> Long ago and far away. Who was <laughs> Tiana Graves? That's my, my uh, assistant after Dasha. What? Tiana arrived. Oh my gosh. She is, she, she is my everything. She's become... There's Scott, there's 
Yeah, Tiana, uh, she actually did these with Poppy, is responsible. This is from her family. No, I've been following She's, it on Instagram, see. but I walked in tonight and I was...